Hi everybody, I'm Patrick Novotny. I am the tie guy. This is my YouTube channel and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie knot known to man and I'm bringing that to you. So if that's the kind of thing you're looking for, then please subscribe. Alright, this time I'm going to show you how to take a regular necktie and turn it into a bow tie. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So taking your regular necktie, put it over your neck. Uh, so we're going to be, you know, sort of tied with both ends here. Um, but starting off with the big end, you want the length of the big end to be one, two, three, four buttons down. So the tip of the tip of the your big end is just uh, pretty much where your sternum is, my sternum is, but it could be somewhere else on you, depending on your shirt size. All right. Um, you can see that there's a huge amount here under that's going to be under the collar. So we're going to pinch our tie anyways. So you might as well just fold this down into in half and uh, make that smaller because if that's poking out of your collar. That's a bit, little bit embarrassing and sloppy, of course. So I'll fix that later. All right, the little end. I don't like it when it come, comes uh, over your bow tie and it's too thick. I think it takes away from your bow tie. So I'm going to fold this in half. I'm just going to pinch the ends together. I'm going to bring that across the big end and I'm going to feed that up through the back of our neck hole and across like so. Tighten this up. This is your only chance to tighten this. If this is uh, a down or if you find yourself uh, not tight, tightening it enough and it falls down, it just looks a little sloppy when it's all finished. So there we go. I've tightened it. At this point, we've got an opportunity to shape our bow tie. We've got this really pointy end here which uh, will not make this very symmetrical. We'll have one pointy end and we won't have a pointy end on the other side. So we want to take care of this. What we do is we take this end and we fold it in into that pocket that we've got in our necktie. And all we want to do is make sure this is nice and even and flat. And uh, there's a couple things that I could do to uh, sort of cheat on this. Um, and one thing is, is I've got this product which my friend has given me. It's called Style Stick. This is not an endorsement. This is not um, a sponsored video. This is I'm not getting paid for this. Uh, I don't have an affiliate link. This is a friend of mine. He gave me a few of these to pass out. And uh, what it does is if you have any sort of wardrobe malfunction or want to keep some clothing in a certain place, uh, this will glue it together. So I'm going to use this style stick. looks like a lipstick container. I'm going to put it on the back of, or actually I'm going to put it on both sides. I'm going to make sure I cover all the edges that I want. And I'm not afraid of doing this just because I've got a polyester tie that I'm doing my demo on. And um, apparently it wipes right off, so I'm going to give that a go. I'll put some up on this side so when I fold it, it's on both sides. Now I'm going to hold this down for about 60 seconds, maybe a little longer. I'm going to fold it down the same way I did before. Exactly where how I want it, nice and flat. There we go. Now I'm going to hold this. All right, I'm going to press down and hold it. Oh, of course, I'll fast forward through this. Okay, so there's about a minute go that went by. If you're looking for a product, if you want to check out what I'm talking about, I'll leave a, uh, a link in the description down below. All right, so now I want to be able to shape my bow tie here. And what I do is I fold it in half like so, and I pull back each uh, side to the middle. And from here, make sure this is tight and where I want it to be. I'm going to fold this. So I'm pulling the big end across. I'm folding it like so. Now you'll find each of these points are not going to be wider than my face. So your bow tie should be about the same width as the, as your head, basically. Um, if it goes past your jawline, it might look a little awkward or might look a little uh, clownish. All right, so taking the little end that's I've folded, I'm going to bring that across the front. So I, I don't have it up right up against my neck. So taking the two bow tie ends, fold it in half. You should be able to find a hole that's gone all the way through. We're going to take this folded end and feed it through there. I'm going to feed the end all the way through. So I'm grabbing on the folded end here and 
the loose end here and now I can tighten this up nice and tight. Now of course adjusting this is pretty much done except for the look and I want it again I want it to be folded in the middle and then looping out or folded the little ends out front to get that look that I'm looking for. If you guys want to have it a little bit different that's up to you. I want to make sure each side because it's not a, actually a bow tie. I want to make sure these look symmetrical enough to sort of get by. So with a little bit more adjustment I can spend a few more minutes getting this exactly the way I want but that's the basics of it. Now what to do with this little end? I'm going to put my collar down now. I'm going to take this little end and I'm going to tuck that into my shirt. Now if I just leave it down, hanging down below and do my buttons back up, you probably will see just a tiny bit or it'll show just a tiny bit coming down. So what I do, I pull it across. And I put that right over my shoulder. So now you have a lot less chance of it being spotted. Do your shirt back up. So now, in a pinch, you can turn a regular necktie into a bow tie. So that is how you turn a regular necktie into a bow tie. I've got so many more necktie knot videos for you coming up, so stay tuned. I'm Patrick Novotny, I am the tie guy, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie not known to man. So if that's the kind of thing you're looking for, then please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.